keep telling you I'm graveyard smoking. I'm going graveyard smoking. Oh, you know I gotta go graveyard smoking. All right. Let's see. Much stores over here. Where the hell's the store that I need? Somebody's playing a horn of some sort. Let's go film them. This is a cool place. They have all kinds of cool costumes and stuff. train of some sort sitting on a track. I'm sure it's historic somehow. This thing looks cool. I don't even know what this is. And this has like some sort of like grater around it. Maybe that's to dig out around the tracks. So this thing's super cool. Okay, so I found the graveyard. Pioneer right Park. Go down these steps here. And not much to speak of, really. It's kind of just a field of dirt with a couple broken pillars. Looks like there might have been some sort of statue up top at some point. And... Are these the graveyards? Are the gravestones? These are just pillars in the ground. I think this is a graveyard. Okay, maybe not. No wait, no wait, what's this? Okay, so we have two people buried here. So I guess it's not really a graveyard, but just... That's eh, something. You know I gotta go graveyard smoking. Hey, there's a boat. Let's film the boat. It's kind of like my dad's old boat. He's pulling a raft behind him. Here we have the dock out in the water. Let me take you down here. See the rest of this. All right. Gotta go yard smoking. Gotta go graveyard smoking. Oh, you know I gotta go graveyard smoking. I sure do have that song stuck in my head. Area closed. Okay, so here's the here's a little path down here. You walk next to the river. There's that building, that glass one that I was just at from the other side, and that's where I was walking across the river earlier. There's the bridge, the rusty bridge I just drove over. Here's some dude in a little boat. And there's somebody on a ski do. I don't know if you can see him this far away. Oh, here comes a big boat. 
Is that? I think this may be a historic boat. Let me try to get a better shot of it. It's really hot out here. Well, maybe not. That's not one of the paddle boats. I don't think. What does that say? Capital... I don't know what this is. I'm zoomed in all the way. Capital Hornblower. Okay, whatever. Some tour ship, I guess. Uh, I wonder if you can hear the water splashing. It's a good test of the camera. Oh, there's our ski do. There's water squirting up at the top. Okay, I'm going to take you over to the other side. This camera is so much better than my old camera. I'm not quite sure what this is, but it's sitting there and it looks old. There's another train sitting there. Let's see, maybe I can climb up here. Nah, I'll just go up to the step. Got railroad tracks. They just like kind of... I guess the train used to come right down through here. Right on the water's ledge. Here's one of the landmarks of Old Sack. This is an old paddle boat that they restored into a hotel. I went online and read the reviews. Apparently they have awful service, but I guess it's kind of cool just to be on a boat. As you can see the pyramid buildings behind it. Right up here that says something about God. Show you the paddle there. It's pretty cool. I don't think it's actually moved in years, decades probably. Empress Hornblower. <laughs> okay. I guess that's another one of those boats, like the one I just saw. This one's a lot taller though. Three story. Pretty cool pyramid building over there. You got the yellow bridge over there. She went there for senior prom. And I actually went to senior prom, surprisingly. One of the good things about having a worldly father. You have somebody in your corner for those type of things. Here's a closer view of the bridge we're coming up here. I thought I might as well get another shot of it. There's a guy with some papers. He's probably gonna hand me something I don't want. Right, 
just to avoid him. Joe's Crab Shack. There's some other people up here with cameras. At least I'm not the only one. Here's a look at the water. Bridge going down there. I probably could walk all the way down if I wanted to, but could film underneath the docks. It's kind of cool, but I'll spare you guys. It's not that cool. Here's the bridge. Ask these girls here, and here we are. Whoa, I'm feeling kind of woozy. I think I need to eat something. All right, here's the bridge. I think it's time for me to get some food and to stop messing around. There's the side of the Rio City Cafe where you can sit outside and watch the river. Look at the pyramid building, the big glass building. It's pretty neat. There's Delta King and Empress Hornblower. Underside of the docks here. There's a whole town, like I see these walls built up. There's a whole town underneath this town. And it's like flooded. So they kept building on top of it and on top of it. But a lot of these stores you go into, and it's like you can go like, you know, two or three stories down into the basements. And there's rumors that they're like haunted and stuff, you know, because a lot of people died in them. Pretty cool. And now I am leaving. My battery is nearly dead, so... This will probably be the end of the video, but... Just thought I'd show you all me driving out of here. did not find the place I needed. The whole reason I came here. I kind of hate leaving with 16 minutes left on the meter. Kind of feels like I am wasting those minutes. And I probably should have got something to eat here instead of just going to fast food somewhere, but I don't know, I'm just kind of ready to leave. Yeah, cross the street, people. I'm waiting for you. You can cross the street now. Uh-huh. Yep. No, I just keep talking. Yep, there you go. Crossing the street, good. <sighs> All right. Oh, and I'm almost out of gas. That's awesome. Gonna have to fill up. I hope I don't run out. Where the hell am I gonna go to get the stuff I need? I do not know. You know, if I was smart, I would have parked in the parking garage. Then I could have gotten a sandwich and got my parking validated, but I'm not that smart. Yep, parking garage right there. Oh well. Well, till next time, guys.